welcome to Shimmer Girl Talks. This is not going to be a long video, but where is Dr. Umar? Because I know he would have something to say about this. And maybe not, you know, I don't want to put words in his mouth. But you have The Bachelorette, which I don't think I ever watched The Bachelorette. Matter of fact, I watched one Bachelor. That was it. The show was just trash. Just never got into it. But I'm sure the ones of you who might stumble across this video probably have more information than I do about Rachel Lindsay or Lindsay Rachel. I think it's Rachel Lindsay. And she was married briefly to a pretty boy chiropractor by the name of Brian. And after he married her, he promptly quit his job. And now that they're getting divorced, she has been ordered to pay over $13,000 a month in alimony to this full grown, able bodied man. Now, when I've had this discussion before about women paying a man alimony, I had men coming at me sideways and crazy, you know, basically saying, you know, it's all about equality. You know, you ladies wanted equality, so why shouldn't he get alimony? And I can't remember everything that I said to that, but. Um, first of all, not all of us were the ones burning our bras and talking about down with the patriarchy. I am still a traditional minded type of a woman. So the ones of you who get mad at, you know, maybe the modern minded women or the feminists understand all of us as women do not, we have not gone down that rabbit trail. This is a full grown man able body and he can foot his own bill sorry not sorry he should not be seeking alimony from this woman now believe it or not i hear you men you say that the laws need to be changed the divorce laws no fault divorce i agree with you guys too i don't think that women should be allowed especially if they tear up their own marriage they should not be allowed to get half of a man's money either. The house and all of that type stuff. You know, because you have some women who specifically go into a marriage to cash out. And I feel that that is what this man did. Because I'm pretty sure however long that $13,000 lasts, he's going to be living with the woman that he really does want on this woman's dime. That's just speculation, just my opinion. I don't know who called for the divorce, but most likely it was her because women by and large overwhelmingly seek divorce. So I don't know if he was a moocher, a loser, you know, but by his looks, he, he looks like somebody who wanted to live a easy, cushy life on some woman's dime who allowed him to do it. And because of, of the way he looks, you know, he'll probably find another sucker. But um, that was my very brief video for today. Tell me what you think. If you know anything about these people, chime in below and I'll talk to you later. Bye.